Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you're new here, please feel free to go on ahead and hit that subscribe button. It really helps out. And uh, on today's uh, episode, we're going to be picking back up in part three of our center console build. So let's uh, jump back into it. All right, guys. So here is how our center console is looking so far right here. Uh, what we're going to be doing is uh, we're going to be starting to uh, make the pieces that will go into here and uh, to kind of finish it off. And then we can start wrapping it and cutting out the holes for the cup holders and everything here. Uh, in order to get uh, the size that we need for each of these pieces, uh, I'm just going to take some uh, construction paper or some cardstock and I'm going to set it on there, turn it upside down, and I'm going to trace it out and I'll cut it out with a pair of scissors and then that should, make, should give me a good uh, reference of what I need to cut out with our plywood. Uh, so we'll go on ahead and uh, start doing that. All right, guys, so we have our first piece traced out right here. Uh, now, since the cardstock that I'm using is a little bit flimsy, uh, I am putting a box up underneath of it to kind of hold it flat while I'm tracing it out. Um, but uh, we got our first piece marked out for the back right here. Uh, this will be the inside uh, floor, I guess, in a sense, of our, uh, of our center console right here. Uh, so we can put stuff in the storage area. And then the next pieces will be for the angles and the different contours going going forward. Uh, so I have it upside down right now. I'm just going to keep putting it underneath and tracing it out, and then we'll uh, cut them all out. All right, guys, so we got all of our pieces cut on out right here. So uh, I'm gonna just kind of try and test fit these in here. They might need a little bit of trimming or sanding, but this will at least kind of give us an idea of how we're gonna have it set up in here. Uh, so here's the first piece right here. Uh, I do have this piece set down in here for the inside of the, inside of the console right here. Uh, and then we're gonna have this piece right here. That we'll drop in. Then we'll have this piece right here. It'll set right into here like so. Right about like that. And then we're gonna have, then we're gonna have this piece right here. This one might need a little bit more trimming. It's kind of a little bit tight right here. So we'll, we'll try that again here. We'll try and get this in here. This piece right here. This will slide on in right here. All right, guys, so here is the panels that I cut out. Uh, they're kind of just set into place right now here. Um, today, it's gonna be, this week's gonna be a little bit of a short video right here. I've got a lot of other stuff going on, but I wanted to get a video out for you guys right here. Uh, so we got these pieces cut out. Uh, the next step is gonna be able to, to is gonna be to attach these right here. Uh, and uh, let me know what you guys think. I've been thinking about making them removable with some magnetic catches underneath here so I can pop it out and service it or change it out if I ever wanna make anything different on this uh, center console right here. Uh, and then as for the uh, as for when it comes to covering it, uh, I was going to do some vinyl wrapping around the side right here. Uh, but it, as for the middle part, I'm I'm in between doing vinyl in the middle 
or I was thinking maybe doing either like a carbon fiber overlay over this right here, or trying, trying to do that. Uh, or um, if I wanted to go the easy way, they have the carbon fiber kind of stick on vinyl that I could put in here. But uh, let me know what you guys think uh, down in the comment section below. I would uh, like to hear uh, your, your thoughts on that. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video this week, and uh, we'll see you uh, next week when we pick back up on part four of the center console build. Uh, if you've liked what you've seen so far, please feel free to go on ahead and like and subscribe to the channel. It uh, greatly helps out, and we'll see you on the next one.